Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to help you work through a common issue that many gamers have encountered. The DX12 is not supported on your system error. If you've run into this problem while trying to launch a game or application, don't worry. We're going to go through a few straightforward methods to try and resolve it. The first step is to check which version of DirectX your computer is currently running. Open your start menu and type DXDiag to launch the DirectX diagnostic tool. Once it opens, look at the bottom of the window where it lists the DirectX version. If you see DirectX 11 instead of DirectX 12, then that's likely the source of the error. It's also a good idea to click on the Display tab in the DXDiag window and verify if your system has a dedicated graphics card. If you only have integrated graphics, some of the fixes might not work as expected, but it's still worth trying every method available. One of the simplest fixes is to make sure that your Windows operating system is fully up to date. Often, the latest Windows updates include improvements and patches that bring better DirectX 12 support. To do this, head over to your Settings, then Update and Security, and click on Check for Updates. If there are any updates available, install them and restart your computer. After your system reboots, run DXDiag again to see if the DirectX version has been updated. Many users have found that simply keeping Windows current can resolve a lot of compatibility issues. Another critical step is to update your graphics drivers. Whether you're using an NVIDIA, AMD, or Intel GPU, having the latest driver installed can make a big difference. For NVIDIA users, the GeForce Experience app makes it easy to check for driver updates that are often tailored specifically for gaming and compatibility improvements. If you're using AMD or Intel, visit their official websites to download the newest drivers. Updated drivers not only enhance performance, but can also address compatibility problems that lead to errors like the one you're seeing. If you're playing a game through platforms like Steam or Epic Games, there's an extra workaround you can try. Some games allow you to force the game to run in DirectX 11 mode, which can help bypass the error if your system isn't fully compatible with DirectX 12. On Steam, right-click on the game in your library, select Properties, and then find the field for Launch Options. There, you can paste the command provided in the game's description that switches it over to DirectX 11 mode. For those using Epic Games, click on the three dots next to the game's title, select Manage, and then toggle on the Launch Options. Paste the provided command into that section and try launching the game again. This method has helped many users, especially if they're on systems with older or integrated graphics that might struggle with DirectX 12. It's important to note that, while these methods work for many, if your hardware simply doesn't support DirectX 12, you might be limited in what you can do. Integrated graphics in particular can sometimes fall short of the requirements for newer DirectX features. In that case, you might eventually need to consider a hardware upgrade if you want to run the latest games smoothly.